So for the lower body 45 degree roll, we need a foam roller and a mat. What I want is your body to be in a perfect line, hips in line with the foot, in line with the shoulder. We'll take a foam roller and our top leg is gonna be at a 45 degree angle to our body. So I'm going down at 45 degree angle and our foam roller is helping to show that. Once we get in this position with our hip stack, we can support our head with this hand and this hand just relaxes on the floor. Staying perfectly straight, this is a very subtle motion. It's just moving at the pelvis. I wanna roll forward. We're reintroducing movement into that pelvis that doesn't involve the entire pelvis and spine at the same time. It's called the relative motion through the pelvis. Very important for learning how to disassociate our pelvis from our thorax is just relearning how to produce this subtle motion here. Now the breath's really important during this. What we wanna do is slow those down. We're gonna do five seconds of inhale as we push our knee away from us. Think about moving one segment at a time and then a five second exhale as we pull our knee, which is moving our pelvis back towards us. Okay. On that exhale, I want you to maintain that ab tension you get when you breathe all your air out after five seconds. You'll feel your side abs turn on. Maintain that contraction as you breathe back in. And then breathe out. Really good for rotational sports where we need to be able to produce rotation at the pelvis separate from the thorax.